Loud you lad. Chill it man. Fuck. Yo people, what's happening? Welcome to the vlog and we are kicking off with a leg workout commentary. So, first thing to note, uh, this finishes at 7 minutes 7 seconds, so if you don't give a fuck then you can skip to that. Second thing, a lot of these clips aren't at normal speed, you can tell that they are sped up a little bit, just because no point dragging it out any longer than it had to be, but... So I'd let you know so you didn't think I was doing turbo squats. Anyway, kicking off with a little bit of a warm-up, just some static and dynamic stretching, mainly dynamic stretches, and the static ones that I do are not going to be held for too long, as I've said in a previous video. Any kind of static stretches, like 30 seconds and over, you want to leave till either after your workout or uh, in the evening before you go to bed or something, um, because they can have a detri detrimental effect on your lifts if you do them pre-workout. I'm uh, going to play this normal speed so I can show you this glute stretch because it's a fucking belter. Uh, the reason I like it so much is because if you're resting on that bench you can kind of take your weight on your arms and then gradually let it go a little bit and you kind of let your body weight push you down and like you sink into it and you know it, it takes a lot of the effort out of uh, stretches a lot of stretches you're kind of trying to pull yourself into the position but if you can use your body weight to force you into it then it's a winner anyway first exercise is lunges so started off with just a warm-up set just body weight so it's kind of exercise you need to warm up for extensively just because you don't want to be busting your fucking knees out man and um you know going into lunges cold is is going to make that happen so uh, body weight and then I did a warm up set with 10 kilograms so here I'm using plates and you see how the plates kind of touch the floor they stop me getting too deep into it so I'll do that for my first weighted warm up set and then I'll move on to heavier weights and I'll use dumbbells so I can get a little bit deeper into it um, total reps for these I was roughly ending up on about 20 reps a side which is right up at the endurance end of the scale and actually your set is taking you like maybe a minute and a half or something and um, you get quite a cardio workout out of it as well so probably not optimal for raw muscle building uh, properties but you know I just enjoy doing them and I feel like they're a good functional exercise and also they, they can put a lot of emphasis on your glutes so if you if you take larger strides uh, you're emphasizing your glutes a little bit more whereas if you take shorter strides then there'll be more tension on your quads so obviously both are working at all times but you can just kind of um, place emphasis on one over the other by doing that so I did three sets of those and then I moved on to calves so I'm putting calves quite near the front of my workout because I want to hit them while I've got you know a good amount of energy and I don't want to end up skipping them and being like fuck this I want to go home so um, doing these I usually do standing smith machine press but decided to switch to these and now i'm just doing single leg weighted uh, calf raises presses whatever um so you can see there that my ankle is a little bit lower than the front end of my foot which just means i can get a good stretch it at the bottom uh, i've also got my hand on the pole in front of me which i'm not using to pull myself up anytime i'm just using it to balance basically because i'm on one foot and i'm not a flamingo all right so i did four sets of those 12 reps each side and then i was on to my second and final press which is squats so i don't really want to ever not do squats if i can help it but um i'll just put them a little further back into my workout so these were just three sets of 12 with 100 kilograms so um again I'm not too fussed these days um, about trying to really push my my weights on squats while I'm doing high reps. Um, I'm quite happy to kind of 
develop other areas and I will come back and hopefully reap the benefits of the added glute and ham work that I've done uh, at a later date and maybe we'll go for go for a PB later in the year or something so three sets of 12 on those and then I'm on to some straight slash stiff leg deads after those hammies baby please so I've neglected hams and glutes um, quite a lot over the last well since since I started training really and it's only been the last year or two that I've really um, put a bit more emphasis on them um, just because I feel like especially if you're like me and you don't have great calves <laughs> that's an understatement of the year um, you do need to do some kind of glute and ham work just so that your legs don't look terrible from behind anyway uh, four sets of those and then I went on to barbell glute bridges which are a bit of a bird exercise I suppose but uh, I think they're great and I actually felt these a lot on my kind of upper hams as well as my glutes and lower back so obviously using all of those but um, yeah it's a good exercise I like it I'm gonna stick with these for a while and again try and strengthen up those glutes so that when I go back to squatting first exercise um, I should kind of reap the rewards and be able to shift some decent weights. All right, final exercise are just some extensions, and I've started doing these alternate legs. So um, I feel like if I do this, I can make sure each leg does exactly the same amount of work. And so uh, every once in a while, I'll go through a phase of training where I'll switch uh, primarily to either single leg or single arm work just because... I don't want any kind of imbalances to um, well get any worse than they already are, really. Also, I feel like if it's less taxing on your whole body overall, you can actually shift more weight um, per leg when you're working out. So I'm not into drop sets or anything like that usually, but since it was the last set, I just did a bit of a burnout with these to finish off. And that's it for the leg workout. So enjoy the rest of the video, peeps. Over and out. Oh. Hi. What's, what's you that you've me? got there? Uh, it's actually, I wasn't going to tell you about this. It's actually a secret, um, it's my secret weapon. I've been using it for some years now. What? Trend? Um, no. Trend crunch? I don't know. Protein crunch, Joe. Um, oh. It's, it's like, uh, I don't know what it's like yet, actually. I haven't tried it. So, give us the backstory, man. So, how much is it? Basically, the backstory was, it's, what was it, one? It was, I think it was just one. Just one? I think it was just one point. One English pie was one. It's just one. One English pound. It was a one, -er, one English pound. Uh, okay, so simple mechanic. The box opens like this. Bag inside. Where? Where? Stand, what? They look like dog biscuits, to be honest, don't they? They do look how They do look doggy, they don't they? Let me see them. Mm. Yeah, they, they genuinely yeah, they have like, like a doggy look. look yeah, they do look like a dog. Um, Definitely got them from the cereal bit, didn't we? Not the dog. What are the macros? The macros? Well, I'll tell you. Uh, for 100 grams, you're getting 376 calories, so that's just quite a standard, standard dry carb, cereal, rice type. Yeah. Um, there's 1.8 grams of fat. That's that's good for 100 grams of anything. 67 grams of carbs, 20 grams of sugar, not bad. There's 6 grams of fibre. Obviously, we're always trying to limit fibre if you eat a lot of vegetables. Well, we it fucking builds up. This is the thing for a lot of people to try and get fibre in, but for it, us, because we eat so much fruit and veg, we need to actually keep an eye on keeping it down. Yeah. Otherwise, just end up like with, Especially with a backlog of turds on. Yeah, you <laughs> need your backlog of turds. Backlogs. Yeah, like, like, <laughs> they make a camp in Calais, man. They build up. Anyway. Alright. Oh, you didn't tell the protein, man. 20 grams of protein. Alright, 20 grams of protein. Whoa, shit. Awesome. <laughs> fucking hell. Alright. So, I'm going to get some out. Oh, they feel sticky, man. They're like, they? yeah, they got a glaze on. Yeah, they got a glaze, mate. Let's try a few at once. <laughs> you don't look impressed, man. I'm trying to figure out what they like. They're tasty. What are they like? Oh yeah. Yeah, yeah. Shit, what kind of? Let me taste them. They like something. I'm, I'm in black, so you, can, you can't see me, man. Oh, they are sticky. They they smell you know, like, like dog food. You know them like corn pops or whatever they, they are. They smell like not sound. Man. Cool. No, they smell like they just come out of a guinea pig's foot. I'll eat them. Man. Dick me. Oh, there's like a gingery aftertaste actually. Oh, actually, they taste okay. They taste quite, they taste quite corny. Forearm. They're like corn poppy. If you don't want pointy elbows, train forearms. 
You know that for forearms Round, right, John? Rounded. My forearms are fucking... Alright, that's Protein Crunch. Verdict, they're alright, aren't they? Yeah, Sam. You used to have absolutely lost it, mate. Go on, lad. I don't know, he's more than fucking melon. Yes, now. Yes to the goose. What's happening? Yes to the mags. So clean. That looks fucking rude. Holy moly. So. It looked better than but I thought you wanted more proteins to put a third on them. You're great. Right, I want to get this. Get Is, this. It recording, Come yeah. close. Is the red dot on? Yeah. Come close, I want to get this. I want to get this. Ah. Oh. Wow, them colours though. Talk to me. Mmm. You cook that power hand? Cut, yeah. Cook it? Like, what do you do? Go and get the eggs by yourself. And just bake it in the oven. That's fucking rude. Hi everyone, today we're doing What is Joe and Mags eating after the gym? Episode 1. <laughs> so we've been to the gym to do some headstands, stretching, boxing, and what else do we do? Abs. Do you do anything else? That was it. So, me and Tom are going to train our birds up, <clears throat> make them solid, and put them into a prize fighter comp, or just face them off against each other. And then the winner wins best slash hardest bird in this general area. Anyway, today we're doing a, a nice little salad. We've got some mango, beetroot. What have we got? That's cucumber, isn't it? Mm -hmm. And we got some mint, lime juice, and olive oil in there. We usually use quinoa, but we haven't got any, so we're using couscous. Some spinach, a few leaves, we do. Dose the leaves like this. Did that look good? <laughs> didn't look good, did Not it? really. But some green lentils in there. That's it, we're just waiting for couscous, so we'll show you, but it's gonna be great. I'm going to try and get into this in the meantime as well. I don't know how to do though because I haven't got a hammer. So I have to just lob it at me bird. See them colours, right? They're the colours of invincibility. Joey D. And his one secret recipe for in fucking living forever. Right, in the meantime, I'll wait for that. I'm going to do this. So you're supposed to do this with a hammer, but you haven't. Well, you might not have one. That doesn't feel sturdy enough, man. Oh, it's cracked. It's cracked. It? Yeah. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> That's all right. Mm. There's a lot of it. Do you want some? <laughs> no. It's all right. I see. I thought it was horrible in the past, but Sam. I like bear grills. <laughs> Look how manly I am. <laughs> yes, now. Look at that shit. This is gonna be a picture of fucking. That is heaven right there. That's paradise, people. All right, we'll drink this. Okay, let's go inside. What we do is we get a little knife and be careful because you don't want to chop your fucking hands off. And just like score it like that. And then... Can try some? Is that the... You, 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 oh, you eat that bit, yeah. So, does that, that brown bit, you eat it still? It's sound. You look like you don't want to eat it. Is that, trust me. Okay, I don't want the full thing. You don't want the full thing? <laughs> Have you, you just made me taste that? <laughs> fucking grand, you know. Is it? It's proper good. Everyone... Jokes aside, this is proper good. Like, proper good. Do you want some coconut, mate? A little, uh, little bit of coconut? Go ahead. Put some macros on it, lad. Fucking fat through the roof, mate. Fucking fat through the roof, mate. It's nice. It's so fresh. 
Nu skal jeg bare et øre. Ja. Det er min camera crews. Way out on reaction. Oh, it's good, isn't it? It's good and rich and fatty. Oh, shit. Is that mine, that? Yeah, I'm just going to quit a little bit. It's hard to get off the thing, but look, then you end up with a shell. A shell, I feel good. Then you can keep your shell as like an ashtray. Yeah. You don't have to use Maggie's hands anymore. So you don't have to, yeah, do it on Maggie's head. Put it out on the face. You can make candles out of it, coconut shells. Can you? I think you can make anything. Yeah. You can make balls out of them. You can make. Oh, we can make you a fucking thing for this. You can make party. balls out of your enemy's skulls as well. Right, yeah. If, if you want. Okay. Make a bikini. I think that's gonna be ready. Let's do it. All right, let's eat this shit. Naughty. That's great. Geese have lost it, mate. Fully lost it. What are you doing, lads? You need to go home, mate. Heavy night, that. Still not home. Oh, wow, that's bright, man. Boy, <laughs> Sunny's on inside. Saturday, people. How's it going? Fuck, this guy looks sick, though. It's a uh, day, is it, man? It's the 23rd. I look, just look like a head on the screen. I'm gonna roll with it, man. Alright, so today we are doing some bulk powders bits. We filmed a couple of videos for the bulk powders um, YouTube channel and stuff like that. Just general, you know, generally getting Joey D's face about. Um, so we're just doing a video about like daily subs and stuff, and then we're gonna go to the gym. And now we're gonna film a motivational video. So I'm gonna be motivational as usual. I think we've got a winner to announce from the the giveaway that I did in my last video. And I'll get someone to choose that winner and I'll announce it in the next clip. Peace. Yeah. Harry Whitaker, you've won loads of subs, message me lad. I'll do more giveaways on YouTube and Instagram, I'll do one every fucking month, so there you go. Just wrapped up, just wrapped up a day of, uh, am I going to get copyright this, is it a famous tune? Do you all know? Really? Shag. We'll see if I do anyway. Wrapped up, day of uh, filming, just for some videos on Bolt Paddy's channel and shit out some photos and that. And uh, it was grueling. It wasn't really, it was just a workout on. It was easy. You just stand there and get photos taken. And sometimes you hear people complaining about, like, oh, you wouldn't actually believe it, but photo shoots are actually really hard. They're not, mate. They're not. Anyone who says that, they've never worked a shift in McDonald's, mate. Like, fucking me. Never done a night shift in Mackey's, mate. Fresh nuggets down every customer because you've been past the fucking amount of time that you're allowed to keep them for. Going home smelling like a fucking grease, just grease ball, man. Just smelling like a fucking Thor's gooch, mate. All right, see ya. <laughs> Thank you.
Hiya. Hiya. I'm curly head back. What a beautiful day. The sun is unreal. Yes, the dog walker. How is it? Mm. Is it great? It's great. Can I get a close up on it? Mm -hmm. Looks naughty. Hi everyone, I'm in Lime Park, which is in Stockport. If you're in the area, you should check it out. If you've got eight quid to spare though, actually, because it's eight quid to fucking park here, which is extortionate. However, it's beautiful. So, me and the mags are just um, doing our, our bi-monthly, he's slipping down the hill. <laughs> the, the mags might slip down, down the hill soon. I slipped down the hill before and got really muddy, but it wasn't on camera, so. Um, anyway, we're doing our like bi-monthly nature trip to just, um, just get peaceful man, just come out and like feel the breeze in the back of your neck and get calm and stuff. Alright, but Mags has provided us with a great uh, picnic, so what we've got is bulgogi, chickpeas, roasted peppers, is they cucumber? Mm hmm Some dried tomatoes, and what's the dressing, harissa? Chicken and harissa. Ch oh, chicken and harissa. And we've also got loads of other shit, medloaf, I've got a photo shoot. On Monday, that's two days. What what day is it? Friday. Friday. That's three days time. I'm just yoloing it, dipping a fucking loaf into fucking hummus. That's the kind of guy I am. All right, I'll let Mags enjoy a picnic now and stop for a little bit. <laughs> Thanks, bird. Show you some lime heart. Mmm, that's good. Mmm. It's fucking great. Yep. <laughs> Cute. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. You like one of them uh, birds off David Edinburgh program? His mum brings it back to it. I'm a bird. <laughs> a gannet. No, not what a gannet. shit. Those ones on David Amber were. They're on the fucking cliff. Birds on cliffs are shit, man. No, the ones that jump off and attack themselves on the way down. Them once. Well, that bit's good, yeah, but the rest of it, they're just living on a cliff next to Oh, you should stab <laughs> me nose with fucking. Yeah. What? <laughs> well, it wasn't snot. <laughs> you just spat me. Don't spit on yourself. I'm a hard I quite like some birds. Put that fucking mango in my mouth. Sorry. Yeah, so much. Oh. Oh. Yeah. That is so fucking good. Mm, silly how good that is. <laughs> no. 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 But. Hmm. Am I chewing loudly? Do I chew loudly? I can't hear you from here. I can hear myself in my own head. I feel like I'm underwater. That's because you you're in your own head. Oh yeah. <laughs> right, one more. <laughs> Fuck you off. Photo shoot, shmoto shoot. <laughs> shmoto shoot. Sounds like a Japanese man. <laughs> shmoto shoot. <laughs> Emperor shmoto shoot. <laughs> <laughs> yes sir. <laughs> oh. Bread doesn't go in a cool bag, does it? No. Where's the normal temperature bags for the bread? <laughs> <laughs> right. Alright, how shall I outro the video, Max? Um, what should I say? Just say bye.
You just say something motivational. Right. Um, what's, I feel like I'm not a very motivational guy. Might you say a joke then? Um, okay. The other day, for my lunch, I had ham and pineapple on a bun. Because that's how I roll. Can you hit it? I think the tractor one's better. Is it fuck? Okay, I'll do. Is it a good outro? It's a shit outro, isn't it? It is a bit shit. For fuck's sake. What? I'm just, I'm just, I'm not actually filming you, I'm just training it on your head. I am actually filming you. Am I a hound? No. Well, now? Alright people, so I'm going to do an actual outro to this video because that was just silly. I was just being a silly fucking Billy man, but it's hard not to and it's just, it's just so ridiculous, isn't it? Anyway, so uh, I'm sorted for Body Power. I'm going to be sending the Friday and the Saturday first half of the days with bulk powders and the afternoons with machines and then the other way around on the Sunday and it's in eight weeks and what I'm gonna do is bulk for the next it's just I say bulk I'm basically just eating whatever the fuck I want man it's not really a bulk but uh, I'm gonna keep doing that for the rest of this month I'm gonna start a, a cut just a gradual one in April and I'm just gonna I don't know what I'm gonna do yet I'm not gonna announce any plans because I'm not fully decided because it's just too, it's still quite early to cut but I don't know fuck no it's body power soon it's spring the sun even in England, that might be too windy. Is that too windy? The sun, even in England, is great. Like me video. Okay, bye. <laughs> like me video. Like me shit. Hey, is it still recording? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Actually, forget that I said like me video. I'm not saying don't like it, but I don't want to be someone who like, says like it. So just forget. Just forget it. Don't not. Don't di Shit, I'm not saying if you forget. Alright. Is the moose here? Meese. <laughs> moose, 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 mice. That's a deer. Oh shit, that's a deer, mate. I was far away. <laughs> it was an optical illusion. I, my, this video is so long. How does everyone feel about long videos? I like doing long videos, you know, because I feel like it's a feature length episode, even if it's just fucking about. It's still alright, isn't it? Oh, another update. See, there's a good job. It's long and we carry on filming. There's another update, right? So, a while back, I made a playlist on YouTube of just like some tunes. It was called Tunes. And I've now updated it. I actually haven't at the time of filming this, but I'm recording it to make myself updated by the time I upload it. So I'll link it in the description. So there's just some like music and shit, because everyone gets on at me. Everyone's like, Joe, make a fucking SoundCloud. Ah. Hi, see you later. Stay there and I'll walk off. Yeah, just, just stay here. Is that good? Uh, do it again. That was great. Yeah, great. I think we smashed it. Yeah. Thanks, Max. It's okay. Jordy Lenny is my hero!